Hi everyone, I'm Andre and in the second episode of in-game photography we're going to explore the photo mode in The Witcher 3. This series will follow primarily games that feature photo modes but may include some that are not. So in this video I'm going through most of its photo mode features from exposure to filters to more photographic technical options such as aperture, raw and things like that. The Witcher 3 is a game developed by CD Projekt Red, set in a fantasy medieval world, it was released in 2015 and it is definitely one of my favorite games of all time, if not my favorite. It has a very large map filled with details, landscapes and creatures left there to be explored, you can absolutely lose yourself in this fantasy world. You can access the photo mode or should I say Nvidia Ansel control panel from the GeForce Experience overlay or by pressing Alt F2. You can even use the keyboard and mouse, also the controller simultaneously if you want to capture the perfect fight scene for example with the help of a friend. The game is very detailed, especially the textures that hold up to the super resolutions like 8K or 16K. Additionally, you can capture them in HDR or in RAW NEF in order to preserve as much detail for post-processing work in Lightroom or Photoshop for example. As you can see the range of filters and effects is pretty remarkable and the depth of field is pretty accurate. You can additionally combine photo mode with the console commands for free camera for example in order to take your in-game photography to the next level by making aerial drone like shots and uh, the kind of shots that you wouldn't be able to get uh, from the in-game camera. I do highly recommend you to explore photography through this beautifully crafted world and if you have great examples feel free to send it to me, I'd also like to make a video from your pictures. As always don't forget to subscribe and like if you like this idea because I'd like to continue and from what you've seen with my images I'm very passionate about photography both in real life and inside those beautifully crafted virtual worlds. See you guys in the next video.